Okay, guys, uh, the topic uh, we'll be discussing today is the uh, composite transposons and non composite transposons. Remember, these are the example of the transposable elements. Okay, to understand what are the uh, composite transposons and non composite transposons, you must know uh, the transposable elements. Okay, what are the actually uh, the transposable elements? Okay. The first uh, transposable element which was discovered uh, is the uh, insertion sequences. Okay, it is the uh, the first transposable element which was discovered. Okay, uh, means uh, it, it is means very simple transposable elements in in morphology and in in structure. Okay, it contains two region. One is called the inverted repeat region. Okay the both side and the second region is the transposes gene okay the transposes gene which is responsible for the encoding of uh, uh, an enzyme known as the transposes transposes enzyme is responsible for the uh, means uh, the means transposition of the insertion sequences remember the first element transposable element which was discovered is the insertion sequences it is the means a very simple it is a 700 uh, base pair long okay it contains two regions the first region is uh, the inverted repeat region okay and the second region is the uh, the transposes gene which code for the transpose this enzyme which which, uh, which the enzyme which is responsible for uh, their uh, their means uh, transposition, okay, and uh, the recognition of the inverted repeat sequence at the uh, target DNA where the uh, these uh, insertion sequences will be means uh, you know look at it, okay. So the composite transposons are means different than the insertion sequences. They contain uh, also two regions as I said before. Okay, the one is the it it contains the insertion sequences, okay, and the antibiotic resistant gene. The second region is the which is contain the antibiotic resistant genes, and this region, the central uh, region, is flanked by two copies of the insertion sequences. Okay, as I said, the insertion sequences can be means seven hundred to thirteen or fifteen hundred base pair long. Okay. Uh, while uh, the composite transposons are only 9300 breast pair long but when uh, there is insertion sequences or when the the composite transposons or the central region is flanked by two copies of the insertion sequences uh, the composite transposons become longer okay uh, it means uh, 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 its actual size is 9300 base pair but when there is insertion sequence at the both sides the composite transposon become longer okay it contains uh, the two copies of the insertion sequences at the both side okay insertion sequences of the composite transposon is uh, 1300 uh, base pair long while the uh, uh, antibiotic resistant gene uh, containing a region is 9300 base pair long okay it is flanked by two copies of the insertion sequences so this is different uh, uh, between the uh, uh, is elements okay insertion sequences and the uh, the composite transposons. Composite transpo transposons contain the insertion sequences, while the insertion sequences itself are short uh, transposable elements. Okay, as I said, it contains the uh, this, this region which is responsible for the encoding of the transposes enzyme. Okay, so in this case, the transposes enzyme helps the composite transposon in the transposition. I'm repeating again that uh, the uh, central region of the insertion sequences which code for the transposes enzyme in this case this transposes enzyme help the composite transposons in the transposition 
okay and the recognition of the target sequence where this transpo uh, where this composite transposon will be transpose or will be transfer okay so this is the function in this case in the composite transpose in uh, is uh, in this case the uh, function of the transpose that enzyme is the transposition of the composite transposons okay so uh, there is another uh, means uh, type of the uh, transposon which is which is the uh, non composite transposons okay this is non composite transposons uh, i i have uh, already discussed about the uh, composite transposons the difference between the composite transposons and non composite transposons is that the non composite transposons uh, does not contain the insertion sequences it is just a region uh, which contain the antibiotic resistant genes okay if uh, i separate this from here and here it only contains this antibiotic resistant genes uh, it does not contain the insertion sequences at all okay so this is means difference between the composite transposons and non composite transposons hope you like this video uh, please subscribe my channel for a more uh, lecture video lecture on uh, genetic engineering thank you very much